Hi friends, we are at Sultan Bateri, a historical monument in Mangalore, which is now called Mangaluru. Mangaluru, one of the prominent coastal cities in India, had been an important port town right from the early historic times till its occupation by the British in 1799. It had been the capital of the Alupa Kingdom during the 7th and 8th century. It was again made capital during the reign of Kulashekara Alupendra, who reigned between 60, 1160 to 1220. The Hoysalas under Ballala III, circa 1291 to 1342, held sway over the region from 1333 CE onwards and it later became a part of Vijayanagara Empire around circa 1345. In 1526, Mangaluru was taken over by the Portuguese. After signing several treaties, they were allowed to construct a factory in Mangalore in 1670. During the first decade of the 18th century, the Nayakas expelled the Portuguese. Hyder Ali, in circa 1763, captured Mangaluru and built a dockyard. Mangaluru was later captured by the British in circa 1768 and Tipu Sultan took it back in 1794. It again came under the British rule after the defeat and death of Tipu Sultan at Sri Rangapatana in 1799. Sultan Bateri, a watchtower, is said to have been built by Tipu Sultan to contain the entrance of battleships of the enemies into the Gurupur River. Though it is a simple watchtower, it looks like a miniature fortress with many musket holes for mounting guns all around. Behind this flows the Gurupur River. All this information is put up on the board there by the Archaeological Survey of India. I have just read it out for you. How do you like it? Thank you. 
Thank you. 